Lifting Up Jesus, opening his word from Australia, Denmark, Israel, Japan, New Zealand, Northern Ireland, Republic of Ireland, Singapore, South Africa, United Kingdom, Thailand, the Philippines, United States, and throughout the world. You're watching L'Oreal TV. Hi, this is Tim Worth from L'Oreal TV and L'Oreal Radio. I'm here with James Jacob Prash, who is alive and very much well in England. Jacob, one of the believers, I had the question uh, about Jewish people. What is the significance of the yarmulke? Okay, the yarmulke is a cultural emblem. It is not a scriptural emblem. The head covering in scripture for a Jewish male was to be a talit, a talit, a kind of a uh, scarf with fringes on it. Uh, 613 apostles, one for every commandment of the Torah, not a yarmulke. A yarmulke developed in the early Middle Ages and beyond as a response to Christianity because Christians would pray with their head uncovered Jews wanted to pray with their head covered. Uh, it has absolutely no biblical basis whatsoever. It is purely, purely a cultural emblem. It's not found in scripture. The scriptural head covering for now was again a talit. Thank you. I'm not, I'm not adverse to Jewish believers or people wearing them under certain circumstances. I'm simply saying that it should not be seen as any kind of a uh, scriptural dictate. 